So yeah, um, last night I made sit down and made some cards um, that I was that Greg and I were gonna give to like the um, our mail lady, our friends, um, you know, just some personalized cards for me. Um, I have a very special doctor, as does Greg, and then you know I have a wonderful dentist. Um, and so I made all these cards last night. I don't know, I made about ten or fifteen of them for us to give out. And then Greg's mom came over and saw them, and she said, um, can I buy these cards off you? She said, they're, like, absolutely wonderful. And she said, I'll give you $8 a piece. So, um, I'm like, yeah, you can buy these. Um, so that's my first big sale. Um, I do not mass produce cards. I don't use a lot of die cuts as far as, you know, where I cut the, them out on the dies myself. Um... I use a lot of embellishments. Um, there's pretty much no two cards of mine that are the same um, because I just don't buy the same. I don't buy bulk paper. I don't buy bulk um, embellishments or die cuts. I just, I just go with it when I get creative. So the first card I made, I have to make this video quickly because she's gonna come and get them. Um, was just a snowflake card I had. Um, actually, it was from the Martha Stewart paper pad with the snowflakes. And I put a snowflake border on it, some snowflake embellishments, and then I put some simple Nouveau drops on it. So that was the first one I made. This is one of my favorites. It says warm and cozy, and then it has the hot cocoa. And, um, I just really love that Martha Stewart paper pad I got from Amazon. Um, I'll link it below if you're interested. But this one says warm and cozy. And I put some little um, Nouveau drops on some of the letters just to make it look like ice. I put some fake snow on the brim of the hat and then a little ball on the end of it. Um, and a couple of snowflakes. And it, it looks gorgeous. I love it. And then... Um, I kind of consider this one more of a male Christmas card. I mailed one similar to my, um, my actual, my disability attorney. When I put some, um, you know, sparkly on the wheels, um, some Nouveau drops on the tree. I have some brads, the snowflakes are brads. And then, you know, embellished it with some more Nouveau drops. But that, I think that would be good for, a, you know, just a male to have as a Christmas card. Um, this is another one that's fun. Um, it says hashtag Elfie. And I put some fake snow and Nouveau drops on the scarf. Um, I put a snowflake on the coffee. And then the little earmuffs are so cute. And it says snow much fun. Um, I put some little swirls um, to indicate kind of like the winter weather and um, embellished it with a couple of snowflakes. And then here's one of my favorites. I always use two pieces of paper to put, um, to back my card with. Um, so, and then I used these wood pieces embellishments to um, put some gloves on and kind of put some snow or ice on them. Two of the, um, snowflakes and then I embellished it with the brown Nouveau drops. This is another one of my favorites. Um, I used a border that says special delivery do not open until December 25th. I put some little um, snow or ice on the truck and on the little bucket. Um, put some little ice on the the um, roof and it just says Mary and then I added a little um, tag and bow and the Nuvo drops. So that one's super cute. Now this one is super simple but I thought it turned out really well. Um, the pieces of it go together so well but it has a gray background and then this striped candy cane striped paper um, and then I used a circled die cut and added the embellished um, 3D sticker, and then I popped up the Merry Christmas on it. This is another one I made that I thought could be for a male. Um, 
just that plaid and the black, um, you know, it's just very simple. It says Merry Christmas to you. It has a little green border underneath, you know, the snowflake. And then, um, you know, the plaid just makes it, could totally be for a male. So there's that one. This one's cute. It says, you melt my heart. And I use Nouveau Drops to add um, some sparkle to the scarf and the mug. I put a little bit of the, um, oh, I can't even think what they're called, um, to put some ice on the, on the hot cocoa. And then embellished with some Nouveau Drops. Added some Nouveau Drops to the snowflakes so they stand out fake snow on the brim of the hat, and then a ball for the for the little sock hat. Here's another cute one. Because I love rustic stuff. I'm from Indiana, so we love all the rustic. Um, but um, it says, Happy Holidays. And then the background, you have the black plaid on the very back, and then the black plaid um, stockings. A little Christmas tree and a little um, crate. I put some ice, um, some embellishments that look like ice on um, around the little boots. And then Nouveau Drops. I love Nouveau Drops, I really do. They're my favorite thing now. This one says, let it snow, bundle up, warm wishes. I used um, a little bit of fake snow on his hat, um, uh, Nouveau Drops on the gloves, added some more Nouveau Drops to the cup and embellished it. And, um, and so that one's really cute. This is another one of my favorites though. This one says Season's Greetings. I used the two, um, the snowflake paper and then um, the Christmas balls and then um, added a season's greetings journal card. I put um, Brad's um, into the sticker so it look and then pop the stockings up so it looks like the stockings are hung on that piece of wallboard. And then just added some Nuvo drops. Oh I also put Nuvo drops in the cup so it, you can kind of see the hot cocoa. So that one's cute. This one is just a card from Merry Days, um, and I added the tag and a um, candy cane, a glittered candy cane embellishment, and put a red and white um, bow, and then just added some Nouveau drops in different spots to accentuate the red. <clears throat> and then this is another one of my favorites. I knew I wanted something to show through there, but I wanted something that when you open the card, it could stand alone as its own piece too. So um, I found this bell die cut and it says holiday love. I put some mini balls on it and embellished it with the brown Nuvo drops. And then another one that's real simple and actually you know, I used this, um, Greg was helping me with this one, and he put this piece of paper behind it, but then when you opened it, the words on the back of it, because it was double-sided paper, were upside down. So I found a coordinating journal card, because he thought he totally ruined it, and I'm like, no, it's fine. Um, I found a coordinating journal card and just stuck it over that. Um, but it all ties together, because it is the same colors. I put a poinsettia right there at the bow. And um, so yeah, that's those are my Christmas cards I created last night. Now I have to go and um, tonight create some more because I've already sold these. And, um, and I'm so happy that I made like $80 for, um, for making cards, which I love to make. And, um, and so, but I wanted to get on here and do this video because um, he's coming to get these cards and they're going out of my house um, in less than 24 hours. So have a wonderful Wednesday and I'll be back soon with some planner videos. Bye.